Hello everyone and welcome to the data visualization section of the course. In this section, we look at data presentation using various kinds of graphs. We'll be using Seaborn for data visualization for the specific section. Let's start by looking at how we can install Seaborn. Seaborn is a library used for data visualization and we can simply import we can simply install Seaborn by using the pip command. We can use pip install Seaborn. Or if you have Anaconda distribution, you can use the conda install Seaborn command. So that will install Seaborn on your machine. So if we go to the Seaborn.py data that org website, we see that Seaborn has certain dependencies. So they divided by mandatory dependencies and recommended dependencies. So we need to install all these dependencies so that we can use Seaborn. The mandatory dependencies are NumPy, SciPy, Matplotlib, and Pandas. So we'll need to install this dependencies by using the pip install command and their recommended dependencies is the stats models library we can install all of those dependencies by using the pip install command so the dependencies are the mandatory dependencies are numpy scipy pandas and matplotlib so to install those, we can simply use pip install and then the library, numpy. pip install scipy to install scipy. And same thing for the rest of these libraries. So if you are using Mac, open up your terminal and then simply type pip install and then numpy, then scipy and so on. If you are using Windows, open up your command prompt and execute the same pip command to install this dependencies and the other recommended dependency is the stats models library so once we install seaborn using the pip install seaborn command and once we install all the mandatory and recommended dependencies on our terminal or command prompt by using the pip install command the next step to the next step is to import all the libraries and modules that we will need for data visualization let's do that next so let's first start by importing numpy and pandas so we have seen this before we can import numpy as np and let's import pandas as pd we have seen those before now let's import seaborn so to import seaborn simply type import seaborn as sns so this is the consensus consensus for seaborn sns similar to numpy as np pandas as PD, we use SNS for Seaborn. So import Seaborn as SNS. We'll also need to import matplotlib, which is one of the mandatory dependencies. So let's do that. Import matplotlib, and then we'll be using the pyplot library from matplotlib. So import matplotlib.pyplot as PLT. We'll be using that and another library or function that we need to import is the Jupyter special function known as the matplotlib inline. So percentage matplotlib inline. So this special Jupyter function matplotlib inline will make the plots appear on our Jupyter notebook. There should be pyplot, not pilot. Pyplot, 
run it again. So we have imported the libraries and modules that we need. Basically, we have imported all the dependencies, right? NumPy, Pandas, SciPy, Matplotlib, and Stats models. From the Stats models library, we'll be using the we'll be using the Stats module. So we can import that now, or we can import this later when we need it in the specific lecture. For now, I will be leaving it like this. So what we can do for the upcoming lectures is copy this libraries and modules and then place it at the beginning of each lecture so that we can save some time. But if you want, you can type each of this libraries and modules and follow along. I'll leave that to you. So just to summarize, we looked at how we can install Seaborn and the dependencies. We saw that Seaborn is a library used for visualization. And once we install the mandatory and recommended dependencies as well as Seaborn on our machine by using the pip install command on our terminal or command prompt, we imported the libraries and modules that we need for visualization. In the next lecture, we'll start by presenting data in a graph. Thank you, everyone.